Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to talk about Bengals Jets and give some of my thoughts as to whether or not this is a trap game. First off, this has been a very strange week uh, in my Bengals fandom. And all the time I followed this team, um, I've never heard so much uh, publicity, you know, positive publicity from the national media. And I'm somebody who consumes a lot of media, so just to hear all the great things that have been said about this team really blew my mind. Now, when the publicity and the attention goes the other way, I'm not, I mean, honestly, I, I don't, I mean, I pay attention to it. I don't take a lot of it to heart because, you know, if this team comes out flat against the Jets, then, you know, some of that might turn around. So I don't spend too much time thinking about that, but it has been strange in a sense, just hearing some of the things that have been said by people and uh, publications who normally, you know, rag on this team. And, you know, honestly, a lot of the criticism has been fair over the years. But anyway, is this a trap game against the Jets? Um, honestly, I do think about that a little bit. As a Bengals fan, it's hard not to think about that. Um, there's never going to be any one Bengals game where I'm just like, this team's got this game in the bag. You know, I'm, I'm always, not to say pessimistic, but, you know, there's always that concern. And, you know, with, with football, you know, so, certain things are just how to control, like injuries and, you know, certain situations arise. So I'm taking this game seriously. Um, the Jets are a horrible, horrible organization with uh, Zach Wilson hurt, so they got Mike White going. This is a really bad football team, uh, but anytime you line up and play 60 minutes, anything can happen. I would be shocked if the Bengals lose this game, but there's always a chance that maybe, you know, did they spend this week reading their press clippings? I mean, you never know. Um, Joe Burrow, to me, is not the type to really uh, play into that. I think this guy wants to win more than anything. He's not the one I'm worried about so much. I think he'll be ready to play, as always. Um, five and two, that's big. Uh, that's exciting. They're the current number one seed in the AFC, but there's still a lot of work left to be done. However, uh, in recent years, the season has been theoretically over by this point. So really excited that we're still playing meaningful, relevant football. Ten games left to go. Most of them after this week are at home, which I think is big. So look, really looking forward to that uh, stretch of time. But, yeah, I just want to give some of my thoughts about, you know, this week's game and the potential of it being a quote-unquote trap game. But as always, I thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you later. Until next time. Bye.